New name, new talent, same old proving ground. Hello everyone, I'm Lauren Bolander and this is Up to Speed. The former Indie Pro Series, now the Firestone Indie Lights, continues to be the top developmental series for those aspiring to be future IndyCar drivers. With a new name comes a long history of developing top talent for American open wheel racing. This past weekend, the IndyCar Series saw seven former Firestone Indy Lights drivers fill the top 10 with 11 total in the field. The race airs today at 4 p.m. Eastern Time, so tune in to ESPN2 for the running of the Miami 100. Going into St. Pete, Dylan Bastatini leads the points after completing his rookie test and claiming victory on his first ever oval race. Second place Richard Antonucci adds another podium to his career and third place Brent Sherman becomes a new daddy. Other notables, Ari Leyendijk Jr. returns to the series with a fourth place finish. Anna Beatrice posts the highest finish by a female. Rookie J.R. Hildebrand charges from the back to a top 10 finish and Panther Racing finishes first and third. Rafael Matos looks to repeat his double victory in St. Pete as he did in 2006. Let's spend a few minutes with Rafael as he talks about the season and shows off his inner old man. Rafael Matos sweeps the doubleheader. Racing for me is all about results and about winning championships. But I think I still have to accomplish something. You know, I, I will be trying to, to win the, the Indy Pro Series title. That's my main goal this year. And you know, hopefully I can help HR to, to with the IndyCar program as well. IndyCar has always been a dream. I grew up in Brazil racing go karts and I was watching Emerson and and later on Helio Castro Neves and Tony as well. So it was something that I was trying to achieve, you know, to, I'm, I'm you know, trying to be in, in any car one day and, and I'm getting closer every day. I believe there's a lot of options with HR in the future. And so I think if I, if I can prove myself one more time, uh, I'm gonna have the opportunity there, no doubt about it. Now I'm gonna show you guys my little toy. I like to drive this car around, it's really fun. It's a Porsche 911, uh, 1977, so kind of feel you're in the 70s. Sometimes I think I was born in the wrong era. This place is nice, diplomat. It's a classic car, so it's the original color, I kind of like, as I said, I, I kind of like old stuff. I like old music, I like old cars, and I don't like old women. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. See you guys at the track. Don't forget to come back to IndyCar.com this Friday at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time for the first Firestone Indy Lights practice, which you can watch here or via timing and scoring. Also, be sure to text IndyCar to 23907 for video updates to your mobile phone. See you again at IndyCar.com. I'm Lauren Bolander and you're up to speed.